But if they could get a little help and close the deal fast, it it'd be good for the family. You believe that, Stone? You believe that? He said there was something in it for me, on my own. I've always taken care of you, Fredo. Taking care of me? You're my kid brother and you take care of me? Did you ever think about that? Did you ever once think about that? Send Fredo off to do this, send Fredo off to do that. Let Fredo take care of some Mickey Mouse nightclub somewhere. Send Fredo to pick somebody up at the airport. I'm your older brother, Mike, and I was stepped over. That's the way Pop wanted it. It ain't the way I wanted it. I can handle things. I'm smart. Not like everybody says. Like dumb. I'm smart and I want respect. Is there anything you can tell me about this investigation? Anything more? The Senate lawyer, Kristad. He belongs to Roth. Cato. You're nothing to me now. You're not a brother. You're not a friend. I don't want to know you or what you do. I don't want to see you at the hotels. I don't want you near my house. When you see our mother, I want to know a day in advance so I won't be there. Yo, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Rashad back with another video. Now bear with me in this video. I don't got the most energy right now. I've been fasting today. You feel me? I'm a little hungry right now. So, you know, I'm just, uh, I'm, I'm operating in the spirit right now. You know, my flesh, <laughs> my flesh is going through it right now. I'm not going to cap. You feel me? But, uh, I don't know. A video just got on my spirit. So I just wanted to get it out right quick. You feel me? Um, keep everything a mystery, bro keep everything a mystery trust nobody you know what i mean trust nobody you know if life has taught me anything it's taught me that to trust nobody you know it tells you in the bible if you love mother father sister or brother more than me ye not worthy of me you know ye not worthy of me you know i trust god that's 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 the only person i trust i trust god and i trust me you know and ultimately i really just trust god you know because i say i trust me but you know i trust me but <laughs> it's complicated you know but uh you know people a lot of people man when you when you tell them your plans you know they they secretly doubt it you know and, and energy is everything you know they secretly doubt it they secretly gossip about what you're trying to do, what you're trying to achieve, you know. Um, you know, most people really aren't visionaries anymore. You feel me? A lot of people are are real. Um, excuse, excuse the sound. We out in nature, but uh, you know, a lot of people are just real worldly. You know, um, <laughs> you know, I'm seeing, I'm seeing with this election, you know. Uh, you know, the people still haven't learned, man, you know. The people still haven't haven't learned, and you got your people running to the blue and running to the red and defending both sides, like either side. <laughs> like either side is, is really on our side, for real, you know. Like either side really wants our best interest. We, we still got people believing, man, that you know whatever president gets elected could change things you know and yes they will change things but not for the better people still have faith in this world you know the progressives the the liberals you know the republicans 
the Republicans believe we can make America great again by, you know, bringing Trump back in. The liberals believe we can make America better by, you know, bringing new things, you know. The liberals believe in change, you know. Things must change. And, you know, that's, that's, that's why I don't really get into to politics, man. You know, I've never voted. This year, I don't plan on voting. If I was to vote, I'll vote for someone that <laughs> people wouldn't agree with. But I feel like if I got to vote for the lesser of the evils, that's who I will vote for. But I ain't going to say who. But I, I don't believe in that stuff, man. You know, that's that's not that's not what's going to change things, you know. What's going to change thing is, things is being mysterious, man. You know, us as... Us as chosen people, we got to be mysterious. You know, we got to start moving in code, you know. <clears throat> Can't let everybody know your, your, your next move, you know. You got to move in silence. Can't create patterns where people can try to predict your next move and sabotage your moves. You know, people are like that, man. People are like that. It's an evil, evil, cold world, you know. So to protect your peace, trust no one but God trust yourself you can love people there's people i love but i don't trust there's people i love but i don't trust when shit hits the fan what they gonna do i don't i know what i'm gonna do <laughs> i'm gonna get out i'm gonna get out and I'm, I'm gonna find my people you know even if that means i gotta isolate you know from family if if niggas don't start getting on cold man and, and i'm starting to get concerned bro because this world got the souls of a lot of people. And um, a, a great divide is going to have to happen. You know, I feel like for me to get on the path that I want to be on, I got to be around the right people. I got to be around the right energy. You know, no disrespect to anyone that I'm around. I feel like ultimately the energy I need right now is just my energy and the most highest energy, you know. Um... I don't <laughs> I don't really feel like I, I really need anybody, you know. Obviously, you know, it's people in my life that take care of me. I'm I'm twenty two but I don't take care of myself, you know what I'm saying? Um, fully. You know, it's it's still a, a, a shelter, a home that's provided for me, you know, food that's provided for me. You know, if, if I wanted to I could just sit at home and not work you know, and be okay, you know, but, you know, I refuse to be a bum, <laughs> so I have, I have a ambitious, I have ambitions that I have to, you know, seek out and fulfill, you know, even though life could be easy, life, life could be what it was when I quit my job a year ago around this time, you know, or, yeah, hmm. It was around April last year. It was around March last year I quit my job. And things were simple. <laughs> I did what I wanted. I didn't have to clock in to some job. I didn't have any money, but things were okay, you know? I had my homies back then that, you know, we'll do things, we'll, we'll go out, we'll kick it. Had homies help me down while I wasn't working, feel me? So things was okay, you know? I know. I know that's a life that could be lived, but what I learned from that <laughs> is unfortunately in this life, you need money, bro. And I'm not one who likes relying on other people, you know? And then when you rely on other people, you're at their mercy. Sometimes other people that you rely on don't come through for you. And then you're just left in the wind. <clears throat> that's why I'd rather rely on myself, you know? Cause I know I'm not gonna leave myself in the wind ever. And if I do, it was a mistake. And I'll do my best and not let it happen again. But uh, I just got a quick message, y'all. It's not gonna be a long video. I know I'm looking um, <laughs> I'm looking like fucking. I don't even know. But my um, I was gonna get my hair done today, but or yesterday. One of my days off of work. So I'm off. I was off yesterday, and I'm off today. But uh, folks that do my hair ain't been around, so. 
I guess I'll just rock the afro for a little bit longer, mate. Until they get back. They've just been real busy, I guess. <clears throat> but uh, long story short, I'm getting sidetracked. Long story short, man, keep things a mystery. Don't tell people your next move. Uh, <clears throat> don't trust anybody. Love people, but don't trust them. Don't give people too much information, if any information. People aren't worthy of it. We in the end times, bro. These cities is for the fall. You know, poverty is rising at a high rate. People are about to get desperate, man. People have been desperate. People about to start selling their souls to these agencies, these gov, these gov agencies, becoming agent Smiths. You know, people already have been doing that, but it's about to become more of the norm. You know, your janitor, your hospital worker. You know, the the the. <laughs> you know. They, they target certain demographics in the workforce, you know. It's a lot of agents in the workforce that you don't even know. You wonder how they got that car. You wonder how they got that home. Because they're agents. They work for the government. You know. I can never work for the government. Well, I guess technically I work for the government. You know. Any, um, any nine to five is working for the government. So, you know. I guess, I guess in a way, I'm a hypocrite of judging people who, um, who fully just do gov government work, like, I don't know, like, spies, agents, you know, I despise those people, I'm like, man, you, you, you're doing the government's dirty work, but, <laughs> then I think, I'm like, hey, I'm doing the government's dirty work too, you know, when I, when I, when I clock into Amazon and I move those boxes around, that's the government's dirty work. You know, that's Jeff Bezos' dirty work. So what's so different from me, from these people that are Agent Smiths doing the government's dirty work? Nothing. We all working for the government. <clears throat> you know. You know, I'm just seeking to be self-sustained, man. It's just, it's going to be a, a, a long process gonna be something that's gonna take a lot of building a lot of groundwork but once my mission is done things will be a lot easier for my kids things will be easier for my kids than it was for me because I've, I've suffered in this lifetime I've gone through depression anxiety suicidal thoughts hurt pain but it's not in vain, you know. All this is not in vain. This is all this has all been an experience. You know? And we're in this life to build an experience. So I'm gonna keep building. I won't stop. There's no quit in me, no matter how hard it gets. You know, some days are easier than others. I ain't, you know, today hasn't Today and yesterday ain't been the best days for me, you know. Um, just energy-wise, I, I guess I've been been drained from working. You know, it's been my first week getting back to work, so you know it's kind of taken a lot out of me, just a lot out of my spirit. <clears throat> and um, I've I haven't really wanted to go out. I, today I've spent the whole day at home in my room, you know. I don't even, like I said, I've, I've even ate today, you know. I didn't even I didn't even plan on fasting today. It was just like the day just started to go by and I'm like, damn, I haven't eaten. <laughs> and now I'm making this video, I still haven't eaten, but my dad is whipping up some burgers and some fries, so you feel me? I have something to eat when I get back home. I just been too lazy to go upstairs and get something to eat. <laughs> I literally just been in my room, playing the game and shit, listening to, um, listening to YouTube videos. But I ain't gonna hold y'all on too long. I feel like my energy is just off right now, so you know, I don't want to. I don't want to um, <laughs> project any more of this energy out. I'll be, um, you know, I get my energy back. You know, get some food. I'll work out later on today. I'll come shoot around. You know, you know, 
usually when my energy is low, it's because I'm not being active enough. I haven't, I haven't worked out these last few days, you feel me? I haven't done anything to physically challenge myself, to mentally challenge myself. So, you know, um, it, it says it says idle time is the devil's workshop, you know? So when you're not doing something constructive, that's when all these demons will start to attack you, bro. <clears throat> I mean, be to yourself, stay to yourself, trust nobody, trust nobody. After dark. You know what I mean? Straight mm -hmm. up. My closest friends did me in. My mm -hmm. closest friends, my homies, people who I done took care of their whole family. I done took care of everything for them, looked out for them, put them in the game, everything turned on me. Fear is stronger than love. Remember that. Mm -hmm. Fear is stronger than love. All the love I gave didn't mean nothing when it came to fear. So it's all good. But I'm a soldier. I always survive. I constantly come back. You know what I mean? Only thing that can kill me is death. That's the only thing that'll ever stop me is death. And even then, my music will live forever. Yeah, man. Don't talk to me about trust. I don't like it. You know what? You should listen to your wife, man. She's right. You are an asshole, man. Come here. Give me a kiss. Come here. Come here. Hey. Hey. Hey, fuck you, man! Who put this thing together? Me! That's who! Who do I trust? Me! Fuck. Trust me. I like that. That's all. Fuck all men, that's all. I need that shit. I don't need him. I don't need her. Fuck it. I don't need nobody. <laughs>